are you? Welcome to another edition of the Monday Morning Cup of Coffee. I come to you from the Balsam Mountain Inn in, uh, I believe it's Balsam, North Carolina, uh, winding up the weekend here, getting ready to go back to Nashville and start back into real life again. It's been, uh, you know, like 10 days on the road, something like that. Uh, went from New Orleans to Houston to Dallas to Austin and basically drove from Austin to Balsam, North Carolina with a nine-hour break in Nashville. That's what it turned out to be. Um, went from Austin uh, 1 p.m. Thursday afternoon, got into Nashville about 3.30 in the morning, Friday morning, left Friday afternoon about 1.30, came to Balsam. Did our show Saturday night with Marshall Chapman. Me and Lisa Oliver Gray did. And now it's a cozy drive back to Nashville and getting back in the swing of things. Um, all that's going on this week happens Friday night. Now we have a group in town called The Long Players. And what they do is they take a classic album and they play it from top to bottom, every cut, and have a different lead singer for each song. And so the classic album this Friday, the 23rd, at the Mercy Lounge, done by the Long Players, will be the R.E.M. classic album, Murmur. And I will be singing West of the Fields, which I believe is side two, cut five, if my college stereo listening memory serves me. Uh, and then uh, they do a second set of greatest hits of that band, and I'm singing Driver 8, which uh, you hardcore R.E.M. fans will remember from the Fables of the Reconstruction record. Uh, so that's all that's going on this week, and thank God, really, I'm glad to be getting home and um, just get, getting into a regular a familial stream of things again. Um, it's nice going out and playing gigs, but it's nice being home, too. So uh, I will see you next Monday morning. I hope you have a good week. Don't let the bastards get you down. And know that somewhere out there, somebody loves you. Good morning.